I still love cooking. I still love to eat. And I still love to create. It was my vision that we would do smaller dining rooms so that you could always feel good energy. I wanted to be a rock star. I didn't want to be a cook. I am a boot lover. I always have been. The crazier the better. Lexus and the Lexus Culinary Masters have teamed up to establish Epicurean pursuits like no other. The boot-wearing, rock star-inspired chef shares his philosophies on life, recipes, and the meaning of Southwest cuisine. On this episode of Lexus Culinary Masters, Dean Fearing. Well, I grew up in Eastern Kentucky, a small town called Ashland. I grew up as a lobby rep. My father was an innkeeper. You know, a lot of handshaking going on as we grew up and being able to have a conversation. And even though I didn't know what was happening at the time, it was actually building my own personality to where, you know, there is the art of conversation. There is the art of listening. Uh, I'll get that sauce going next and then uh, we'll taste that. Yeah, and I think the Marsala with oh, this will come I have out. a great relationship with my staff. And I always have. I mean, I learned in my early years of chefhood that if you do not take care of your staff, your staff won't take care of you. In my head, I can taste things without having to taste them. I mean, like right now, if, if I wanted to think of garlic and raspberry, I can think garlic and raspberry and kind of put that together. To come up with something new is exciting. That's what I love to do. And I've loved to do that for the last 35 years. In the late 1970s, Fearing honed his skills at the Culinary Institute of America, then landed a job at the Maisonette in Cincinnati. However, it was the next stop in his journey at the mansion on Turtle Creek where his famous tortilla soup was born out of a request by the owner of the mansion. So Miss Hunt exits the kitchen and Christian Shemin looks at me and takes a piece of paper out of my hand, looks at it and says, I can't believe she's gonna make me do a peasant soup on the menu. Well, it's been my million dollar baby for many, many years now. For me, it was very natural to say, I need to do a Texas style cuisine, a Southwest cuisine that had all of those indigenous flavors, chilies, peppers, cilantro, lime, jicama, and paying customers, I think nowadays, deserve the wow. You know, if they're coming into my restaurant to spend money, I want them to have the best of it. I want them to have the wow. Gentlemen, welcome. Glad you all are in. Good to have you in, Robbie. Mike, how are you? And it's Good. what like I love about Lexus dealerships and their service program is exactly mirrored with my restaurant. And that's what I get about Lexus. I get that experience that I want people to feel in the restaurant. And I do. And it's what I love about it. And it's why I'm on my third Lexus.